For healthcare givers and residents of the Sisala West District of the Upper West Region, the arrival of a new ambulance will save lives. For years, they have struggled to work on poor roads and used tricycles and motor kings to save lives. Bright Nanamfo reports the lack of an effective ambulance service has crippled work of health caregivers. <laughs> A community member devoted his own motorbike to be supporting them. Anytime there's a pregnant woman and the, the woman begins labor any hour, they use it to carry the pregnant woman to Tumu Hospital. It's very difficult in Sesala West District. Already the terrain is difficult, roads are difficult, you can't even cross. Somewhere you can move within 30 minutes, you are in a community. Here you will move about two hours before you can hit a community with difficulty. It Anybody could come out to work on the roads for us, if anybody could come to give us an ambulance, if anybody could come out to give us equipment. The plea of over 66,000 population of the Sisala West District. For years, they have struggled to save lives and limbs. But there are challenges due to unavailability of an ambulance. The roads are cut off. Around August to September, there was no way. Some communities, the health team could not read them to immunize children under five, to render services, home visiting, and others. The Pando, the Bele, all those communities, from August to September, there's no way. When a woman is in labor, is a community members that will try to carry the woman. The district has a poor road network and no two communities are linked by a tarred road. And so, referring pregnant women to the nearest facility is a challenge. They will not go. Sometimes they, they even make the attempt to go. But in their process of going on the way, if they realize that the baby head is almost out, they feel like branching to the TBA and then just delivering at the TBA site. What has helped is the community emergency transport system. We are trying, we are engaging with communities to support, convey their clients from the cheap zones. That's some are very far away. Bele, those are all communities. So we are talking with the communities to try to support their pregnant women and children under five to JFC. We are talking to them to establish community emergency transport system, which some are doing. Even this has challenges because in some cases, motorcycles and tricycles are unable to do what healthcare givers want done. Some communities, however, have managed the emergency transport system well. We have Timir community just by, they have been able to procure a motor king. A motor king, so that motor king, anytime there's emergency, mostly the children under five and pregnant women, they are able to convey them any hour to the nearest hospital. For Sisala West, the new ambulance is a savior. Despite a poor road network, the arrival of the ambulance will ease pressure on healthcare givers. They will now be able to transport pregnant women to centers with ease, and lives will be saved. Bright Nananfo, TV3, Golu.